This video is a part of a new playlist I have just created called Corrections and Updates, and I thought I would put any videos that I create to answer any questions, and this is the first one of those types, so I hope you enjoy. All right, this video is for Jay on YouTube who asks, how does the Commodore 1541 Ultimate 2 Plus work with multi-disc games, and how do game saves work? Well, I thought I would demonstrate that. I have the Commodore 1541 2 Ultimate 2 Plus plugged in and I'm going to go in and select uh, Ultima 2 as an example and then I'm going to run on, select the program disk. See how there's a player disk and a program disk? Select the program disk do run disk and then we'll fast forward the video okay so here it says P to play the game or C to make a player we're just gonna hit P to play the game I love the sounds coming off of the 1541 Ultimate 2 Plus because it makes it sound authentically like a disk drive. Okay, here's where you do something. It says insert the player disk. So now it's asking us to switch disks. So how do you do that? Well, it's really simple. See how there's three buttons? Well, all you do is you come in and you press the one in the middle. That then switches the screen back to the menu and then you switch by using the up arrow, the cursor up, to the, the player disk. And then instead of run, you do mount. And then that switches you back to the screen where it says to press F1. Then we just press F1. So it's, it's that simple. And then as far as game saves, now that it's, it's, it's like you've mounted a floppy disk in the drive. So all the saves and everything happen onto that file that you've put onto, so that you've loaded onto the 1541 Ultimate Plus. And I've used this flash drive and I have the ROM locate, loaded onto that, onto that flash drive. It emulates a disk. So that's how the game saves work and that's how you switch disks. I hope that answers your question. Thanks for watching.